Okay, what is up, guys? MLB The Show 22 content finally here. It is April the 5th. MLB The Show has released, and we have no money spent for you. First time doing this series, but it should be fun. So we're just going to hop right into it. I haven't gotten many studs so far. Just started playing, but first thing, I'm just going to go through. Today, I may not... This is kind of what to do just on day one. And this is kind of an overview of what you're going to be wanting to do over the next few weeks. So... There's a bunch of things you can do, but the number one thing I'm going to start off talking about is the faces of the franchise program. The features program is going to give you a lot of packs, especially like these flashbacks and legends packs, give you some good starts. Do your daily moments and stuff like that. I haven't done it yet, but you can do some feature program moments, do all that, get do some missions, all this stuff, and get, you know, a bunch of 90 overalls. That's one good way to start. Make sure to do those faces that program that is going to be essential for you and then also we have the babe ruth starter program that'll be good for helping you on the way get some packs to start out with um the other programs too the single player modes mini seasons um so we have here i a lot mini seasons looks cool but you look at the goals this 989 evan longoria okay i've learned this the collections near the end of the year like you see Go over to collections. By the way, live series, Randy Johnson. Looks fire, but you'll want to collect him eventually, but we don't... We'll get to that later. But go to Legends of Flashbacks. Eventually, there will be a big collection where you can collect everybody in one collection and get a big reward. There may be three or four of them. So what you really need to focus on, collect... All of the cards you can. Maybe not grind many seasons. You don't have to, like, grind it. But over, like, a month or so, if you can complete a season and win the championship, that's pretty good. So, get a few packs. Get some prospect choice packs. And get that 89 Evan Longoria for your squad or just for your inventory. Um, Conquest. I'll be making Conquest videos again this year if you watched my channel last year. And also, make sure to go subscribe if you enjoy our content, by the way. And, but yeah, Attack um, fate. well, don't need a tutorial, <laughs> but Conquest is a great mode, get a bunch of packs, um, hidden rewards all over the place, I'll be giving you those when, like, the first big Conquest maps come out, I guess, and then Showdown, Showdown, you have the starter, Showdown, if you can just grind through this, this one should be really easy, again, you can get good rewards showdown is a good way also to let's focus on the game really grind 99 as ramon would say um rank seasons i don't co-op by the way i don't think there's any rewards for it yeah they'll probably be adding that later but right now i don't think there's any rewards rank seasons um that's kind of mode where you play try and it's again it's like the online mode battle royale i didn't do this last year i highly suggest doing it next year or this year because no, I don't want to do it right now. <laughs> because if you can go flawless or even just do the missions, get Larry Doby, and then look at all these beautiful cards. Pedro, Craig Biggio, Chipper Jones, Andrew Miller, Jason Bay, all goons. You do all these, you get you can get custom draft rounds because they added that this year. Very cool. If you get all the way up there to 100 points, though, and then pass that some major packs and some really, really good players, some high-end players, that are going to be great. So make sure to do that as well. Events, you can also do that because that can be good. I don't recommend that as much as Battle Royale. Events can be really good, though. If you can't rack up enough wins, Nolan Ryan... Uh, Alfonso Soriano is pretty good cards early game, <clears throat> but yeah, and make sure you save up your stubs. Stubs are crucial to this game, but thank you if you are a Nintendo player. Um, welcome to the channel. Um, excited to have Nintendo into the game this year, and yeah, so that is episode one of No Money. So kind of a quick episode just to run down things you can do. And, yeah, we'll be back with episode two, hopefully tomorrow, maybe the next day. But thank you for watching. I will see you all next time. Peace.